the rear PTO is I can uh, choose my uh, my speed selection in, uh, in in several ways. I could uh, either navigate to my uh, my rear hitch um, tab on here, and again I've got my uh, my speed selection uh, down here. Uh, for that one, so I got uh, 540, 540, 1000, 1000E e, uh, from there. I could uh, set up uh, one of these uh, these quick jump tabs uh, from here, and I can just touch on the, on there for it to uh, select a, uh, a PTO speed, or if I want to put it back into uh, into neutral, I can uh, select my PTO speed. But if I've forgotten to do that, and I do the uh, double press of the uh, of the yellow PTO button um, to uh, engage the PTO, and I've got no P uh, speed selected, as soon as I do the double tap on there, then it brings me up then the, uh, the, the, the option then to uh, select a speed uh, from there. So even if I haven't gone in to uh, my rear linkage page or I haven't got that tile uh, set up, I can still uh, pick up a, uh, a rear PTO speed. If I've already got a PTO speed selected, so we can see up here I've got, uh, I'm showing that I've got 540 uh, selected, is again, if I don't have this quick jump tile or I don't want to go in to the, uh, into the rear linkage uh, page, what I can do is on the, uh, on the yellow PTO button uh, for the rear PTOs, I can press and hold that, keep hold of it, and then again, the, uh, the pop-up uh, window comes through for a uh, for a speed selection uh, on there